Here we are in October. As we get into the fall months, it becomes mating season for yellow jackets. And what you see here is mating behavior for German yellow jackets, or Vespula germanica. You see a new queen on the left, mating with a male on the right. And they will engage in mating behavior throughout the fall months until the queens are inseminated by the males. Then the queens will go and hibernate over winter. And once they wake up in the spring, each queen that survives hibernation, and not all of them survive, but those that do will go out and start their own nests. So if you see this type of behavior this time of year between two wasps, that's what's happening. There's a male and there's a female, and they're preparing to bring their genetics into the next season. When she's done, she twists her body away from the male, and they disengage. Here's another couple mating at a camper that had a nest inside the trailer hitch that we were removing for a client. We came in late during this film clip, so the queen is just about done, so she's trying to disengage by twisting her body away from the male and kind of nipping at his abdomen with the mandibles she has as part of her mouth. But the male's not quite done yet, so he hangs on, and they keep engaging until the female starts to nip again at the male and try to twist away. And here we're going to show you what that looks like. When she decides she's had enough and she's ready to be on her own again, she'll start nipping at the abdomen of the male and twisting her body pretty aggressively away from his. And that's what she's trying to do here. Their anatomy kind of locks together during mating, so it's not easy for her to disengage, but she's working on it. Eventually, with enough nipping and twisting away, she finally is able to disengage. Once the queen disengages, she may mate with several other males during the mating period of the year, and then she'll go into hibernation. But here, this male is still hanging around. It looks like he's not quite done yet. So sure enough, he comes back to try to re-engage, but she fights him off. But he's still not getting the hint. He's hanging around. He's circling back. His instincts are to keep trying to mate. And when she's done, she's done. No means no. But the male's been kicked out of the nest. They don't let him stay there anymore because he doesn't bring in any resources. So once he's kicked out, his only job in life is to mate. So after they groom a little bit here to clean up, he comes back and tries again. Sure enough, she rebuffs him again. This time he gets the message and he goes away, maybe to find some females that are a little more receptive. So off he goes on his own. Now this female has been inseminated, so she can go into hibernation now or she can go and mate with some other males. Either way, her genetics now have a chance to carry on into the next season.